my main inspiration is the fact that life is absolutely beautiful um, and I want people to know that and um, yeah be alive there you are My name is Deadly Knit Shade. Um, I am a graffiti knitter um, and I have created this bench today because I add colour to the world and this is my colour. The story behind Who Done It is that I want to encourage people to take what they love um, and release it into the wild. So in my case, I love knitting and the colourful, so that's what I do. I'm a graffiti artist, but it's it's removable and it's basically it's, it's handmade huggable art that you can take home. So I decided that I was going to cover a park bench in knitting um, because park benches really don't get enough love. Um, so I worked on this in my studio. It took two weeks working every single day, but designing and setting it all up took about another week. And there are over 5,000 metres of yarn in this bench alone. I am sad when I leave my work behind. When your art has a face, it does tend to break your heart a little bit. But people come and take little bits of my art home and their faces, they kind of light up, so I don't mind so much. <laughs> the guy with the dog said that it was um, somewhere nice for him to sit down for a little while um, and have a cup of tea and that it, it cheered him up. Maybe I'll knit a dog and wear him on my shoulder as well. Colour outside the lines. I, I colour outside the lines. Pretty much with everything I do. I mean, obviously with this, but I, I always encourage other people to think outside the box, colour outside the lines, just be different in the world. Um, yeah, my entire flat is absolutely full of colour. A giant squid in the hallway, space invaders on my rug. I don't tend to go for beige. Beige is not my thing. My life is quite colourful. My friends are quite colourful. So if I had a colour named after me, I think it would be knit shade blue. It would probably be some kind of match with my hair. And it's, you know, it's nice and punny. I, I quite like colour outside the lines. I, I'm stealing that. 